today we are doing a car review of one of my best friend's cars, John Cedeno. <laughs> His name's Cedeno, but he's Italian. So Cedeno, you gotta put that in there. I've been having a ton of fun with the past two car reviews and uh, it's just fun showing off my homies' cars, driving some cool cars and just going over other people's builds. This is John, one of the TC twins. You guys have seen them in a previous video of mine. Him and his twin brother both have TCs. He has the bagged one and his brother has a static one. I think that's literally the coolest thing ever. A bagged bro and a static bro. That's awesome. You got the best of both worlds. Give us a little overview of your car. This is my 2011 Scion TC. As Bobber said before, it's on bags. It's on air tech struts with 3P airlift management. The wheels I got are Wed Cranes LXZs. Some big wheels. They're 10 and a half, four inch lips, six and a half inch barrels. That's Ooh, a lot of inches. Can... Yeah, some big. <laughs> there, there's some big wheels, bro. How big were the barrels? Six and a half. That's like four more than you need. On oh, God. <laughs> I got some luminous window tint. Wait, what percent is this tint? Because you can't see through this thing at all. It's... 15 or 20. 15 it's or light. 20? Yeah. And John just did literally, what, how many minutes ago? Two hours ago. Go. <laughs> Just got the front windshield done. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> With the front windshield, it looks so much better. Before, he didn't have the front windshield yeah, tint. A little, a little wacky. The tints look super light because of the light coming into the car. But bro, it looks so hot boy now. Especially with the wheels and the low glow. In the front, we're running Spec D headlights. Coming to the back, we're running Spec D taillights. Okay. We have an Amazon duck bill that doesn't really like to stay on. Oh. Came paint mash from Amazon for like 100 bucks. That, dub. That's a dub, dub, dude. We just put this on last night, too? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this whole car was built yesterday. Yep. Pretty much. Uh, basically. <laughs> you can't really see it because it's like super bright, yeah. but you guys can see it right over here. Yeah, we got some logo. Yes, action. sir. Yes, yes, sir. How much till you're running in the front, my boy? The ooh. Front, negative wait, 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 wait. That's a, ooh. -hoo -hoo. Negative nine degrees of camber in the front. Negative 10 to 11 in the rear at air out. 10 to 11. Jeez. So in the rear, I have Megan Racing camber arms. And then the front, they're cut and welded, extended lower control arms, extended tie rods. So you're running a slotted top hat and you're still not rubbing your bag against the strut tower? Nah. Did you bang in the frame at all? Nah. Nothing? TCs are just built different. You know what's weird though? Is that your front camber looks more than your rear. And just because of the dummy tight fitment. That is some tight. Hi, Fitment, bro. No loosey goosey stuff nah, going on there. No loosey goosey. Fun fact: when I air out, my fenders actually kind of really expand a little bit. That tight Fitment with no spacers. Wait, let's see the back. Let's see the back, baby. Damn, bro. No loosey goosey over here. That's a custom exhaust, right? That's a, oh yes. Okay, so it's a <laughs> 2011 to 2013 Scion TC Estudo exhaust. It was a cat back, mm -hmm. but I cut the cat and I cut the resonator, so it's like straight. Now it's just a back. Yeah, just a cat. <laughs> There's nothing besides a cat. A cat. It's a fake cat. Really? Yeah. What, the, what do you mean fake cat? It's what like does that even mean? Chinese wooshy juicy cats. Wooshy juicy? Yeah, some Ling Long cats. <laughs> <laughs> had a long glass pipe that used to come out like this. Yeah. It used to be like high. Yeah. I just hated it. It was very ricey. So I just took hacks on and just cut it. Well, we all do things when we're younger. Oh, yeah. Can you also tell the boys um, how old you are? 19. 19 years old. Bro, how crazy is that? My boy's 19 years old. Has a stance car with some good fitment. Flex it. it. Yo. Oh, yeah. My man got a daily too. Yo, good on you bro showing the trunk setup Ooh. okay it's a nice little simple trunk setup yeah. it has harbor freight logo bang it has boof glow yeah bro <laughs> so i just cut off some twinkle lights out of the box got some five below strips and just spliced them together now they have a bunch of different modes fun fact boys this is the air tank out of my sti you have a little bit of my sti yeah, in my you beersy. oh yeah and your <laughs> beersy you know that song i'm carrying your love oh. with me nice. did you clear this out or is this already clear yeah the third, uh, that's also off of eBay. Okay, so that was yours though? Yeah. Okay, okay, that's fine. You didn't black out the roof, right? That's just how the roof is? Uh, actually, the whole roof is glass. It's a panoramic sunroof. Panoramic? Yeah. Panoramic. Panoramic. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> but I, I like the sunroof. No wipers. Man of culture. Yes, sir. One reason why I love the TC twins is because, in my opinion, they made TCs cool. Like, you guys made TCs cool. I wasn't a big TC guy. I think a lot of people aren't really TC fans, but they made TC cools, in my opinion. His brother has the static one. He has a bagged one. It's the perfect duo. It's just so awesome. The TC twins are 19 years old. That is 
crazy. It blows my mind. They have some cool ass cars. Right now we're seeing John's car. We'll do Joey's car another day. That's the static one. We gotta go for a ride along. All that good stuff. Yeah, his car ride's great. Really? Yeah. I don't think so. No, I, I think you're lying to me. Shit. <laughs> I, know, I had a feeling you were lying to me. Let me hop in your ride, baby. Okay. Fully whited out. Not fully, but the trim pieces that could come out. Yeah. Sprayed them. NRG hub and quick release white and gold. Yes, sir. Wait, does it do Excellent. the? Does it do the? Yeah. Do the thing. Do the thing. Yes, yeah. sir! <laughs> it does the ding! Yo, my man is matching his interior. But, uh, no, I mean, that's a walk around of his car. Uh, you got a bunch of things planned for over the winter? Yeah. All right, so one thing I want to tell people about is your Fitment, right? Like, walk me through, like, what you have to do to get this Fitment. How do other um, people get their Fitment tight like this? Because a lot of people got some loosey-goosey Fitment. They do. Well, on TCs, at least, you just buy wheels that you think are oversized, and then you make them fit. <laughs> I feel like that's terrible advice. Yeah, it's pretty bad. <laughs> it's pretty bad. So I'm just gonna um, buy my old wheels and they're gonna try fitting 13 inches into here. So for the rear to get fitment like this, camera arm originally from Megan Racing, I was supposed to give you like four degrees of camera. There's three nuts in it, so it's like a lock. Another one that's just there to space it out, and then another one that actually holds into the arm. We took that out and just like flanned it out. Gave us like negative 12. And so you we just took just pieces to off the it. camera arm? Yeah, and then I had to grind down my quarter right here to make the wheels fit. So you literally just took an angle grinder yeah. and just said, you just yeah. sent it. Oh, wait, so you see Joey's? His is literally paper thin right here. Really? Yeah, that's where he crushed his arm. I'll I tell mean, you about that in his review. <laughs> I see the front fit, uh, fender thing that you mean. The fender's yeah, popping out. It's popped out a little bit. That's tight. <laughs> oh, you're checking the fitment? I don't think it's going to slide in there. Nah, I don't think so. Oh. Oh, oh, uh -oh. no, nah, it's still pretty tight. It's not going past that. What would you have to do for the front? When I first bagged it, it was sitting at like negative six. I wanted to put like the fenders and air it out. Wait, it's negative six with just the top hats? Uh, No, just the slots Okay. and the top hat. So like the slot on the strut and then the top hat slot. And as soon as I landed, fender to lip in the front. So like brand new replacement <laughs> fenders immediately buckled. <laughs> so I was like, all right, I'm done with this fender to lip light. So cut and welded the lower control arms by an inch and a half. So you extended the lowers? Yeah. Okay. Okay. which gave us about another three-ish degrees of camber. It was still really tight, like just about fender to lip. So what me and Johnny, EK Johnny, did mm -hmm. was we aired the car up, shoved newspaper and cardboard, and just kept on airing it out, which kind of like rolled the fenders in a way, <laughs> so that it kind of launched out a little bit. So you put newspapers and just started airing it out, yeah. and that's how you rolled the fenders. Mm -hmm. They don't look clapped though. They're not bacon or anything. Bro, you guys discovered something new. Even seeing this in real life, bro, this is perfect. It doesn't it is. look bacon or anything. So why buy a fender roller when you can use cardboard and newspaper? Bro, that's so fire. Yeah, I had a fender roller nah, you could have used, buddy. Nah. Bro, even the other side. Look at that. Bro, it's literally perfect. The craziest thing is that he just aired this thing up, stuck some newspaper and cardboard, and sure. aired it out. And bro, these things aren't bacon. People bacon their fenders when they actually use a fender roller. Yeah, you just that's what I didn't want. So like, we heated it up one time, and then the, the paint kind of like started to bubble. So we're like, all right, no more. So what we did was just dropped it. While it was sitting like this, we just kind of took it and like pulled it. Bro, that's so and fire. It, it took like 10 or 15 minutes each fender. The fenders came out beautiful. Get on you, buddy. Good on you. Hell yeah. All right, let me see inside the car. This thing is a big body. God damn. Bro, you can see right through this thing. This tin is so easy to see through. A lot of people probably like this car. Yeah. And now they're going to see something, which, oh my God, oh hold no. on. <laughs> oh, no, I know where you're going. Oh, you know where I'm going with this? Right, so the car oh, no. is... Okay, wait, wait, wait. Like, <laughs> wait, let me, wait, let me see the keys. Where are the keys at? All right, let's just pretend I'm John and I want to go start my car, right? Put the keys in, reach down for the cook. The, the, yo, where's your clutch at, bro? <laughs> oh, so it's a Bluetooth clutch. It's, it's a like Bluetooth. A, it's a clutch delete for weight reduction. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Not only is John bagged, but he also has the auto. His brother has the manual, but yeah. you wanted the auto. To be fair, your goal isn't to rip this thing on back roads. No. You like stance and fit yeah. and stretch tires. Yeah. It doesn't really matter. I feel like yeah, auto is better for you. Yeah. Hand out the window. You know, just straight chilling. I know a lot of people aren't gonna like the fact that it's auto, but like at first I didn't like it either. I was conning you like crazy. Yeah. You but still then do. I still do. It's, it's <laughs> fun. It's fun. It's a little fun, but I understand it because there's really no need for manual when you drive a standstyle out car. You're not ripping this thing, so like why? Yeah. It's just extra work that you have to do for no reason. Plus, I like to ride low, so like that's one less thing I have to worry about. Oh, I mean you still have to worry about a lot when you're riding low, but that's one less thing I have to worry about. I love it. I love your car. And uh, yeah, you made TC's cool, in my opinion. Thanks. Yeah, I liked your TC before I liked Joey's. I'm gonna be honest. John knows this. I hate to say it because I love John, but I like his brother's car just a little bit more than yours. 
Just but, but you know why. You know the only it's reason why. Of his it's only because of the front bumper. John likes stock. He likes stock body. He stock doesn't body, like the stock bumper. I yeah. think that's OEM I like. So I gravitate towards that. Yeah, I love front lips. I love kits. I love front yeah. lips. I love side skirts. But John's getting a front lip soon. He's getting a whole brand new front bumper, a new front lip, everything, and side skirts too. So your car is gonna be way nicer than Joey's. Yeah. Sorry, Joey. <laughs> what kind of sucks about this is that the first time I rode in this car was yesterday. We decided to do this car review last night slash this morning. I wouldn't have rode in it yesterday yeah. if I knew today I was gonna ride in it. So yesterday I technically had my first impressions already. It, this isn't my first impressions, but I already know this car drives like a fucking dream. Yeah. It drives so smooth, bro. Built it's not to, even funny. Built to mob. Built to mob? Yeah. <laughs> it's a little bit loud for my opinion. Like I would it's, want my car a little bit quieter. It is a little loud. I mean, you're also 19. <laughs> you know what I mean? No, no, I'm just saying when I was 19, I had a straight pipe Tome. When you're 19, I feel like you want the loudest possible exhaust. You're nah. still pretty tame with it though. Yeah, I don't, I don't like drawing more attention to myself than I have to. That's very mature for 19. That's a lot more mature than I was at 19. Nah, I'll rip it every once in a while, but like, yeah. no, but if it's somewhere like that I don't need to be, I won't. Yeah. Plus, this is in my daily. I barely drive this car, so when it does, I don't want to cause any problems. He's not kidding, guys. I've almost never seen this car. <laughs> I've almost never, ever seen this car. The only time I see this car is when it's sitting out in his driveway. Yeah. So, like, riding in it, like, that's why yesterday was the first time I rode in it. Yeah. The, the oppers. <laughs> the opera stoppers. The oppers are really bad over here. Yeah, I yeah, know. I got but a mail-in ticket for yeah. a loud muffler, bro. Well, your car is loud. I mean, I have no muffler. How are they gonna get me a ticket for that? All right, so my car is like, people say my car is loud. Yeah. Your car is louder than my car. Yeah. So that says something. I can I can control it though. Like, if I want to like super loud, I could. You know, right now you push in the clutch and all the sound goes away. <laughs> I didn't like that. I didn't like that. Yeah, it's a little, it's a little too loud. <laughs> yeah, no, this car drives so smooth, bro. I tuck tire at ride height and it still drives as good. Do you I don't really? ever get yeah. tucking rear or the front? Well, all around. Yo, we got the GoPro right now. We can check if that's cow. Go ahead. You want, we're checking? Come on, wait. Right, let me adjust, let me adjust. Wait, oh, no, 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 it's not, not the height. Right it, right. It, it, it aired up a little bit. Oh, right? okay, okay, little... whatever you want to say. Well, I have 40. All right, go ahead. All right, we're going to check it now. All right. Yeah, you're going to catch me live. Bro, you are tucking though. That was no cap. Yeah. No I cap. Tuck. Tuck. Sheesh. Wait, I gotta check the front though. I went to go check the front. And I the, <laughs> the front ain't tucking, my boy. The front ain't tucking. The front ain't tucking. If you ain't tucking, you ain't fucking. Uh, okay. Oh no, it's right, right, there. right there. I see it. Alright, let's go. We chilling. We chilling. Yeah. I'll hop out real quick. You got it. Yeah. <laughs> it's right there. Got this. Oh, fuck. <laughs> fuck. Pop it in reverse. <laughs> fuck. Throw it in reverse, Terrence. <laughs> Yo, we're good. Bro, the hat's good. It's chilling. Perfect condition. Bro, perfect condition. <laughs> Let's go. Bro. And then he puts it right back on. Of course I gotta put it back on. <laughs> There's a Troy or Dolores. DeLorean, so Troy and Dolores. DeLorean. Yeah, DeLorean. DeLorean, there we go. There's a lot of nice Back cars to the future car. Alright, so note to self, never do that again while never ever. Yeah. Oh, you're you're talking. Talking. You're tucking. You're tucking rear. rear. And it's rear. still comfy. Comfy, yeah. Which is what we were saying before. Right? I can't wait for you to get your front lip on and your side skirts on. <laughs> I'm, I'm being so serious, bro. It would look so much better with a front lip and side skirts. Just those two little things are gonna make it so much better. If you guys wanna see more of this TC, go ahead, follow him on Instagram and TikTok. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.